My name is Dmitry. I am curator of entomology collections uh, for the Manchester Museum. Uh, I am going to tell you a story about industrial melanism. The story is uh, an excellent test case of the Darwinian theory of natural selection. It's a story about peppered moth. The peppered moth is a nice uh, moth occurring uh, in, in the vicinity of uh, Greater Manchester. There are two color morphs uh, of this uh, uh, moth. One is a white and speckled uh, kind, uh, which is a typical variety of the moth. The second one is a black uh, moth called Carbonaria. Both kinds exist in nature, however, they exist at different proportions. In natural and damaged environment, 95% of moths exist as a white moth, and only 2 uh, to 5% of moths exist as a black moth. The moth uh, normally rely upon camouflage uh, as a means of avoiding predation by birds. However, during Industrial Revolution, tremendous changes to the environment took place, basically because of coal uh, burning industry, which uh, released huge amounts of coal smoke, which actually caused blackening of uh, the environment, including uh, tree trunks and branches. On a certain and the blackened trees, uh, black morph became more invisible for predatory birds than the white morph. At the mid of 19th century, only 2 to 5 percent of uh, moths were uh, black. However, by the end of 19th century, almost 95 percent of moths, moths were black. Scientists didn't know what would have happened to them, but immediately the first hypothesis was released that it was differential bird predation which caused these differences in the, in the moth population. In the mid 60s, the amount of coal smoke uh, was reduced due to the uh, governmental legislation. After this, environment has changed tremendously, and this has caused backward changes in the uh, uh, population of peppered moth. 